so this is another obstacle course we've made. As you can see again, it doesn't really look like we've made anything, but we have activities planned to go all the way around that will help us get back into our green zone, okay? Um, this is also really good for a cold day like today. As you can see, it is very cold and snowy outside. So if you need to get your energy out, this is a really good way to do it. Uh, for this one, we're gonna start carrying some heavy books. So I had these textbooks just laying around at my house. So I brought them and I'm gonna carry them all the way over to this red chair. Oh, there we go. And when we have heavy work, it stimulates our joints and helps us, us calm down and get back to our green zone. So that's a really good thing to do if you have heavy objects or anything in your house. Next one is I'm gonna take this blanket and if you were in our class, we played parachute and gym, so it's kind of like that. You're gonna throw it up and then sit on the floor and have it land on you. And then you can lift it back up. If you want some extra input, you can fold the blanket. If you have a heavier one, that would work great. But you can fold it back up and put it back on your chair. There we go. All right, Miss Brass, I forget what's next. Oh, we're gonna somersault. So now to get our vestibular input, so that's knowing where your head is in space and where your body is in space, we're gonna put our hands down and we're gonna try to somersault over like this. Ta-da! And if you want, you can do a back roll, any kind of roll you want. And then I'm gonna step over this big, huge ottoman. Next thing, if you open and close doors, that's really good heavy work too. So we're gonna open. Yeah, I don't want to close that. We're gonna close it again. And then I'm gonna really reach up, up, and stand on my tippy toes and walk all the way over. I think I'm gonna keep going all the way to this red chair. I'm gonna pick up my books and bring them all the way back over here and set them down and then I could do it again. Another fun thing to do would be to have timers involved and time how fast it takes you and how many rounds you can do in a certain amount of time. That would also be really fun. And as you can see, I'm out of breath, which is good. 